Hi guys, I'm going to be showing you how to paint Thor's logo, part of my first Avengers series. So make sure you guys like and subscribe, I post every week. And without any further ado, let's start the video. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is make a mark in the center of your canvas. How you do that is my canvas is a 8 by 10 inch canvas. So I'm going to be making marks at every 5 inch and every 4 inch. Then you just connect them. Once you've found the center of your canvas, I'm going to make a mark at 3 inches and then I'm going to draw a circle. Once you finish drawing the circle, I'm going to draw my image inside the circle and paint everything around it black. Once you've finished painting the background black, I'm going to take a piece of cardstock and I'm going to use the same measurements and cut out a circle. Once you finish cutting it out, I'm going to then add tape on the circle and put it over the image you just drawn. Once you have it on there, I'm going to take a toothbrush and some light gray paint and I'm going to lightly spray the background. Once you've finished with the toothbrush, I'm going to take a paintbrush, dip it in the same gray paint, and fling it on the canvas. I'm going to keep doing this until I like the end result, and then you're going to let it fully dry. Then I'm going to peel the cardstock off. Once you've peeled the cardstock off, I'm then going to paint the center of Thor's hammer with the same gray I used on the background.
once you finish that, I'm going to paint the background black. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to sign the painting. After I get done signing the painting, I'm going to mix a darker gray and then I'm going to color the handle. Once I finish coloring the handle, I'm going to color the top and then I'm going to color the little strip on the sides. Next, I'm going to use the same color and color the rim around the circle. Next, I'm going to mix a slightly darker gray than the center of the hammer and I'm going to paint the sides.
Once I finished painting, I'm going to take a Posca pen and I'm going to line the hammer. Next, we move on to my favorite part, varnishing. Now you can use whatever varnish you have, but I'm gonna be using Mod Podge. Once you finish varnishing the sides and the top, then your Thor painting is done. Hi guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it and until next week, bye!